Take us through the end of regulation and the role that you went on to force the OT. Oh, man, you know, just being aggressive uh, personally. Obviously, we got just enough stops. I mean, man, look, Jay, it, this got to be his first career 2020 game. You know what I'm saying? Like, this, this is a monumental occasion here. Because, you, you know, know that's, my God. No, that's my guy. That's my guy. Like, board. Jay is my guy, and we're back at the crib, or as close to the crib. Hey! Oh. <laughs> Bring it back here. <laughs> Finish your thought. Finish no, your thought. No, so I'm saying, he's back home, man. He got everybody in the stands, man. 2020. Like, we'll do it without him. And then at the end of overtime, it was Joe. You know what I'm saying? It was Joe making shots, uh, which we needed. Wow, that's hitting my compression shorts. I'm going to bring Jared. I'm going to bring Jared in. But what does this say about the belief for this team that you guys pulled off oh, this game? We're a resilient group. I know it's one of our principles, one of the thoughts that Kenny, one of the words that Kenny has, like, for our team and as, like, a foundation or whatever. And uh, we showed it tonight. Appreciate you. Let's bring in the 2020 guy close to home. <laughs> <laughs> how how good does a win like this feel, Jer? Hey, it feels good. We started starting a road trip. We're coming out. We're starting strong. An overtime win against the Houston Rockets. And how about your performance? First 2020 performance of your career. What was the difference for you tonight? Just activity on the glass. They didn't have a big rebound there in for the whole game. So I just made the effort to crash the glass every time when that showed. Go enjoy with your teammates, brother. Thank you. Thanks for joining us.